air signs people this is the energy vibration reading for the love i want to say i'm so sorry that it is so late but mm. it is here all right my darlings let's see what is coming up this love reading is for um the aquarian gemini's and librans so um let's check in please remember um to become a member of my channel you have to use the link here and to subscribe to my channel the link here and to the notification um the link there all right so all of these readings for the individual signs aquarian gemini or librans so you can find them on my website but you have to be a member in order to pick them up on the medium medium 499 okay so ladies and gentlemen aquarian gemini's and librans let's see what is coming out in love for you guys in this month so what we're seeing here we're seeing the ace of cups so new love is coming in for you guys and this is wonderful then we see some of you um i've met, met someone new and you're trying to figure out what should you do should you stay in the relationship you're in or should you leave i see a new start is coming in for love for you air sign people some of you want a new start it might be it might not i see some of you want a new start with a taurus virgo or capricorn person 50 years and older i am not sure if this new start is going to be coming in okay um, then I see you're dealing uh, with a new offer of love is coming in for some of you um, So that is good. Okay. Uh, I See you're seeing a situation clearly with um, you liberals are seeing a situation clearly um, about a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person um, and um, However, this is going to be coming out. We're going to be looking at that some of you are dealing with a fire sign person, whoever this fire sign person is in the Aries man. Whatever is transpiring, I see truths are coming out um, for this Aries man. And I see a situation where some of you could be divorcing this Aries man, whoever this person is and whatever is going on, you could be divorcing uh, this person. So I see divorces coming up if you're in a relationship with an Aries man. Divorce is coming up. Now, secrets is coming out about your partner, whatever is transpiring information secrets is definitely coming out about your partners whatever that was happening and transpiring i see some secrets and information is coming out okay i gotta pull this up ladies and gentlemen okay so let's see yeah there we go um all right so let's go in this so new love is coming in okay um some of you um could have been in a relationship but i see an offer of new love is coming in however that is happening and transpiring uh, be open tell the other person about the other person and it will be okay i see some of you want to start a new start with a taurus Virgo, or capricorn person but i don't know if um the um offer is going to be coming up i see you will be saying this uh, um, but I don't know. I see an offer is coming in from a Libran, whoever this Libran is. Um, another Libran could be offering, or I see an offer could be coming up uh, um, for you Librans. Ooh la la. All right. So, um, truths are coming out. Um, whatever is transpiring, um, you Librans um, could be getting divorced and finding out something um about uh, a um a um aries man i see truths are coming out you're finding out something about an aries man that is going to lead to a divorce okay then i see definitely um new love is coming in um this new love that is coming in i see you guys are working on this new love you are open to this new love and you want the um, to um, make a chance take a chance take a chance on this new love I see truths are going to be coming out whatever that was transpiring truths are coming out if you were seeing someone and someone new comes on on the scene I see truths are going to be coming out people are going to be um, realizing that you're seeing two people at the same time however that is transpiring I see some of you are going to be making a choice a between a Pisces and a Virgo okay some of you have to make a choice between a pisces and a virgo 
um, whether or not this uh, um, this choice is that you could be in a relationship with a Pisces and a Virgo or a Pisces could be coming in but a Virgo is in love with you I see communication is coming in I see some of you are going to be communicating um, to a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person and saying you know um, it could be a Virgo or a Capricorn and saying you know I I you know you know reconsider maybe something can happen for us I see some of you are definitely protecting yourself um, or protecting your partner however this is transparent it's as if you're protecting your partner protecting yourself from an issue or a situation okay some of you are protecting yourself because someone wants a new start um, some of you are protecting you new love is coming in so this is a double whammy new love is coming in for you airy um, um, air sign people a lot of new love and of new opportunities if you're single looking to mingle this is going to be the month because a lot of new love is coming up for you then I see um, I see um, some of you a fire sign person wants to return in your life this is an Aries wants to return in your life and it's going to be offering you love whoever this Aries is and whatever that has been transpiring between you and this Aries woman I see she wants to return in your life and she's offering you love um, she could be offering an apology okay something could have happened it could be your child's mother and she's offering you an apology so be aware of that I see a cycle is over some of you are going to be ending a cycle between um, you and an Aries woman um, because this is not working so if you're in a relationship with an Aries woman, I see you're ending a cycle between you and this Aries person because it's not working. Um, you could be ending a cycle with a Sagittarian person because it's not working also. I see some of you are um, love is being offered from a Sagittarian. I don't know what is happening. A whole lot of love is coming in. Um, there you go. There you go. I want you guys to see this. A whole lot of love. This is the second um double whammy of uh, new love that is coming in so some of you are really in love with a um a capricorn person uh, i see some of you are really really especially men um 50 years and older you're really in love with a capricorn person um some of you could be in love with and is trying to choose between a capricorn and a um taurus a capricorn and a taurus some of you could be trying to choose between a Capricorn and a Taurus. So then I see news um, is coming in um, from a, a fire sign man, whoever this fire sign man is. I see news is coming in, but the news is not really positive. Or the news that is coming in is that he wants a new start, and I see you are going to be saying no. I see some regrets. Regrets. Some of you are having some regrets. Regrets. Uh, um, um, this is emotional regrets. Having regrets um, with a situation um, with a fire sign man, you regret it ever been ever in connection with a fire sign man. However, it is coming up or transpiring, the regret is here. I see definitely a healing is going to be coming in between um, you and a divorce. So there was a divorce, okay, and I see an healing is going to be coming in. So however that was transpiring and happening, there is definitely a healing is coming in after the divorce. Some judgment call is coming up on a fire sign man. Um, it's as if uh, there is a divorce or some of you are going to be serving this person a divorce. Um, but I see um, with the divorce, it's like um, a corporation institute is saying, you know, yeah, um, you know whatever has transpired they're choosing for you ear sign people i see some of you were dealing with a sagittarian man um and there is some regrets between you and the sagittarian man so um if you are a um an aquarian um gemini or yes obviously you're an aquarian gemini or Libra. There is some secrets about this fire sign man, and I see some of you are going to be finding out if you're in a relationship with a fire sign man, you're going to be finding out some secret about this person. Okay, so new love is here, 
um a lot of you men 50 years and older is going to be falling in love with um a capricorn person some of you could um have to choose between a capricorn and a virgo let's um go deeper in the reading so i see some of you new love is coming in and you're working on your relationship uh really some of you are going to be finding out that you're pregnant um some of you information is going to be coming out that if you are in a relationship with someone else and you met someone you have to make a decision what is going to be transpiring I see um, decision making you men 50 years and older is going to be finding out something about a Taurus and um, a Sagittarian whatever is transpiring you're going to be finding out something about a Taurus and a Sagittarian now whoever the Sagittarian woman is she wants a new start she wants works on the relationship so if you're married or in a relationship with a Sagittarian woman she wants to she feels sorry about something that she has done and she wants to work on the relationship people who are in relationship with a Virgo I see a Virgo is coming in and I see a lot of love is coming in some of you a Virgo could be getting married or getting um, pregnant for you or is pregnant for you I see an offer is coming in but I see you're ending a cycle and uh, there was uh, the energy of a fire sign person and this could be an Aries person in your life and it's as if no I no longer want to be with this person and I see you want to go for a Capricorn person because um, it's as if you and this Capricorn person connect um, in a um, a spiritual way okay and it's definitely a Capricorn it's coming out both ways as a Capricorn now um, whoever is in a relationship with um, an Aquarian with, with, with a Sagittarian I see some regrets I see some regrets because you're finding out the truth um, about a Sagittarian I see some of you could be divorcing of an Aries or a Sagittarian I see regrets you guys are regretting relationship marriage with a fire sign and I see divorce because all of this is coming up with divorce I see children are being affected with this divorce whatever is transpiring with a legal issue um, some of you I see that some of you liberals are offering a Capricorn love um, whatever is transpiring is as if this person um, open up your heart chakra and, and, and this is good because it's really um, creating a lot of wave in your art chakra a lot of you are going through divorce and there is some regrets that you're having at the end of the month because I see you're realizing something that that you weren't aware of true because of this divorce you are seeing people and situations so however that is transpiring so when we look at um, some of you decision decision um, some of you are going to make a decision whether or not you'll go forward with a Taurus a decision is going to be made over a Taurus some of you are working on your relationship a new love comes in you're working on your relationship some of you are offering love and want a new start with someone and some of you are open to new relationships and open to a new start a lot of you who were in relationship with an Aries person you're like oh, no you know I've gone through this I've made the shift um, I'm not seeing it happen a lot of you're working um, if you're in a relationship with a Taurus some of you might want to work on this relationship or some of you um, might want to just let it go um, I see a lot of you are protecting your children in a divorce whatever is transpiring you're protecting your children in a divorce and I see that you're making sure that your children is going to be supported for um, so that is true so um, <sighs> Some of you who are dealing with an Aries woman 50 years and older they want a new start but you're like no um, I care about you but you know it didn't work out so let it go um then we are seeing communication whatever the deceptiveness the communication um, some of you um, someone is offering you love but you're like we have gone through this let's not go back through this because there was so much hurt and pain a lot of you are carrying burdens that was created by a fire sign person and I see whoever this fire sign person is a judgment call is coming down on this fire sign person so new love is definitely coming in some of you are seeing the truth 
that you were in this um either loveless marriage and you're going to be deciding to let go of this loveless marriage okay so let's look at um new love so i see a lot of you singles um or meeting someone new you're speaking with your girlfriends about this this is good you're feeling good about this new love for this new love that is coming in and you're feeling very good uh, you are realizing that uh, you know um you could have been in some bad relationship in the past and now you're changing the way that you're looking at relationship and this is good i see an um and um aquarian gemini or libra is going to be calling you they want to make some decision they want to make a decision whether or not but this person is it's like they're in love with you they don't want to say um that they're in love with you and they're trying to figure out how you feel about them so they they can make a decision either they can let go and move on or i see a tower moment is coming down so some of you whoever is in a relationship with a five sign person and this person have a child for you maybe you are married to this person i see a cycle is going to be over with this person i see you are letting go of this person because you see that there is no chance for you and this person i see some of you are going to be making some lt relationships and choose for a taurus virgo or capricorn person whoever this person is whatever is transpiring I see you definitely going to be choosing for this person. You realize that it is the best way to go and the most healthiest way. I see the offer of an engagement is coming in. I see news is going to be coming in. I see a scorpion is going to be sorry that they had not jumped on the, the um, you, you know, take it when it was there. So I see some of you an engagement is going to be coming in and uh, cancer is going to be having some regrets because they realize that, um, they could have left you for someone else and they realize that you're now getting engaged and they're feeling sorry. I see you liberals are really um, upset. You liberals um, realize that as Pisces that has left you is now engaged with someone and you are upset. Some of you were engaged to a, a scorpion and the scorpion has left you. There are some regrets and you're like mad with the world. I see... A fire sign person, a Sagittarian is saying, I love you. I really care about you. I see they want to express this. Some of them might express this. Some of them are afraid to express it. So however, this is coming up. I see they're, they want to let you know that they still care about you. So if you um, divorce or um, I, I think this person has this secret that they want to let you know that they still love you and they still care about you. Some of you are in a relationship with a Sagittarius. You're going to be finding out they're, they're still in love with their wives, okay? Um, I see that some of you are chasing after um, a, a relationship that has ended. And it's as if you don't understand that. Let it go. Let it go because you're chasing after this person, but this person has moved on. And it's this time for you to let go, okay? So you could have divorced from this person, but you are still having contact with this person. And I think that some of you must realize now, um, it is over. It is over. See that this relationship has gone through its course and it is over. Some of you are chasing behind, are chasing for a scorpion and the scorpion no longer wants to be connected with you. So um, however it is coming up and transpiring, you got to let it go and realize that the end of this relationship, it's over. So, you know, it's time to move on. Okay. So let's get deeper. So I see that some of you are going to be wanting to work out a situation um, with a Capricorn or a Gemini. Okay. Or a Virgo. So I see some of you wants to reconnect or some of you are going to be reconnecting with um, a Capricorn or a Gemini and you want to work out a relationship. However, that is transpiring. Then I see um, the Scorpions and the Cancers. Some of you are seeing the truth about the Scorpions and the Cancers in your life. Whatever that was happening with the Scorpions and the Cancer, the truth is coming out. Some of you are going to be working on the relationship with the scorpion and the cancers. 
um, you see the truth and you're going to be thinking about let me work on this relationship okay but it's as if uh, um, you know they're calling you you're taking the call and you're trying to resolve whatever that was going on between you both uh, love is going to be offered to you from a Leo and a cancer a Leo and a cancer is going to be offering you love are you ready for this love do you want this love from this person I see a tower moment could be coming down um, and some of you are protecting yourself um, from a, um, a Capricorn and a cancer some of you could be finding out that uh, um, if you're in a relationship with a cancer or a Capricorn they are seeing each other and you're going to be realizing that uh, they are connected with each other they are like soulmates and you're going to be letting it go then I see the energy of uh, um, the Sagittarians and the Gemini's so you Gemini's are going to be letting a Sagittarian know how much you care about them and this is going to be good so men 50 years and older you're going to be letting a Gemini um, a Sagittarian know how you feel about them now I see Uranus and cancer this is affecting people in relationship with a um, Aries woman whoever this Aries woman is um, I see that she wants uh, she could have had uh, an affair with an um, Aries or cancer and um, this was someone you were married to and I see you're going to be ending the relationship a psyche is over with a Pisces and a Libran um, so you Libran if you're in a relationship with a Pisces a psyche is over you could be getting married you could be ending this relationship or you could be thinking to end it new love is coming in and I that's what I keep on saying that you liberals are in love with a Capricorn you could end up marrying this Capricorn you're definitely in love with this Capricorn and you could end up marrying this Capricorn news is coming in that I love you and this is coming from um, a Capricorn or a Aries so a Capricorn or, or a Aries some of you could be receiving um, some of you could be one to um, you know engage a Capricorn or a Aries um you want to ask them but you don't know you want to tell them but you don't know it's kind of weird um then we see some regrets because some of you were um in um in third party relationships you were flexible you were open you were dealing with you um um an aquarian um a libran and a sagittarius so it's like a, a love triangle is going on and some of you have some regrets you, you could have found out about a love triangle that you were part of a love triangle seeing the truth about Leo and a Taurus the truth is coming out about Leo and a Taurus and what has happened and transpired so whatever is transpiring I see information is coming out about a Leo and a Taurus so you could be in relationship with a Leo or you could be in a relationship with a Taurus and information is coming out about them but because the spirit is about secrets about your partner is coming out then we see Sagittarians and cancer Sagittarians and cancer I see um, a, a couple could have created some burdens for you guys let's say that you change couples uh, um, you were having relationship with um, other couples I see that um, some information is going to be coming in a couple that is a Sagittarian and a cancer is carrying a lot of burdens and they could have created burdens for you or you're going to be finding out that they're in a, they're carrying a lot of burdens in their relationship a judgment call is coming out on an Aquarian and a Libran um, where if you're in a relationship with an Aquarian or a Libran or you were chasing after a Scorpio I think the Scorpio is going to say back off I don't want to be in this relationship so however this is happening and transpiring then I see Elin if you're in a relationship with a Libran or a cancer I see Lib um, um, Elin is coming in so if you're a Libran in a relationship with a cancer I see Elin is coming in so um, this is absolutely um, unbelievable but yet still good and if I haven't called out your partner um, or who you are in a relationship with um, it is okay all right so um, there is nothing 
strange going on in your relationship let's say that um and it is going to be okay this is just a time where secrets are going to be coming in these secrets is going to be bringing freedom in your life so let's go a little bit closer and look so i see a whole lot of talks some of you singles are connecting um with a um a capricorn uh, so some of you singles are going to be co connected with a capricorn a lot of um phone calls with a capricorn i see the end um a devastating end um with a um sagittarian woman and a cancer woman um so some of you could have some devastating end with a sagittarius or a cancer woman it could be same-sex relationship um but you men look out now healthy relationships i see a lot of you are going to be trying to build healthy relationship with a with a with a, with a pisces uh, okay, so some of you will build a little relationship. I see um, new love is coming in. I see that some of you, a Pisces, might um, want to ask you and in married, but don't know how to ask you. I see um, a lot of I, you know, people are open up to relationship with you guys. So if you're open, whoever is in a multi relationship that has to do with an Aquarian, um, a Libran, and a Sagittarian. I see that they're going to be finding out. Um, some of you could be starting this open relationship. However, this is transpiring. Some of you are going to be stepping back from this relationship. Um, so it depends on who you are and what is coming up for you guys. So, so let's see what is the message that is going to be coming out for love for you, air sign people. Remember, in order to um check out and see what is transpiring in your own zodiac sign you have to become a member of the channel 499 you receive every extended in the month okay so let's see i see courage have courage find courage so it says find the inner strength to face fears and confidence you have the energy of purpose so i see a lot of healing is going to be coming up in your relationship and this is going to be a wonderful time to heal relationship secrets are coming out and this is going to be good so ladies and gentlemen i'm wishing you a wonderful month um go check out the extenders and i'm saying namaste until next time